Hey, welcome back to Good Day. Nice to have you with us on this Thursday morning. Uh, if you haven't checked the calendar, uh, the year is half over. <laughs> Already, where did the time go? You probably set some goals at the beginning of the year, like we all do. So where are you when it comes to where those goals are in relation to where you are on the calendar? Cynthia Bazin, our live coach, is back to help you kind of dial in the second half of the year. Okay, the time has flown. Absolutely. It's July 19th. We're actually into the second half of the year by a couple weeks. It's unbelievable. Yeah, it's but shocking. We We've got time, but what we got to do is we got to dial it in, Marianne, dial it in and figure out what's been working, what hasn't, and then move forward and get things done for the second half. Right, it's a good time to reflect back on if you if you were trying to reach your goals, what wasn't working about that? Exactly. Okay, all right, so we got some tips here for you. Number one is take inventory uh, of your goals. Yeah, take inventory. Write down all the goals that you put in place for the year. See what's working. If it's rocking and rolling, keep moving on them. But remember that, you know, less is more. So maybe you've overwhelmed yourself with too many goals. Maybe focus in on one and then and move on to the next one and I always say to people that I work with is that not all goals are critical so the critical goals are ones that could shut you down so start with health goals start with financial stuff and then move on from there sometimes that really helps people focus in on which ones are really important all right good advice all right number two make the goals specific and measurable right so do you just kind of have a general goal say for example of you know getting fit or writing a book or getting more money you know into your life be really sp specific and there's a thing called smart goals I'm sure you've all heard of right and it's by George Duran and it's you know specific measurable attainable are they reachable and are they time bound oh, it's an acronym I guess yes yeah. absolutely. Yes, it yes 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 Put yes it all right. so write that down and yeah. go back and see if that goal you know fits all that criteria if it does you have more you know possibility of getting it done all right good one all right number three make your why super strong you really have to want your goal really, really bad. And there's a great quote. Do you like quotes? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, by Eric Thomas. He says that, you know what, if you want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful. So do you really want it, right? right? So if you don't really want it, maybe it's not something that's important. Maybe somebody else said you should do this sort of goal, but maybe it is important. You gotta find that why. Why, you know, is it so important for you to get it done? You know, so maybe it's somebody, you know, else, you know, maybe it's to make your family happy. Maybe it's to fit, you know, into a dress or feel good for the holidays. So you've got to have something that makes you want it really bad as okay. much as you want to breathe, as Eric Thomas says. That's, yeah, most people want to do that. So you can tie it to that. Uh, number four, five accountability right so in the first half of the year you know did you hold yourself accountable did you no. utilize a journal did you put stuff on a spreadsheet um, did you track the results or did you have an accountability buddy or a mentor so if you didn't really find that accountability for yourself find what really works so if you didn't do very well on your own maybe you need to find that accountability buddy or that mentor or coach to help you mm -hmm. uh, or maybe it's just a matter of you know what just really tracking being able to write it down yeah that's good that always helps a lot and last but not least uh, this is the best one. Put yourself as a top priority. Non-negotiable. 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 <laughs> non so, so, you know, honestly, if you didn't achieve your goals in the first six months or you haven't really moved forward, ask yourself, did you focus so much on everybody else? Were you giving and maybe supporting everybody else's goals? You know, now is the time to rally in your supporters, put some boundaries in place and say, listen, guys, listen, gals, you know what? I need some help now on the second half of the year to achieve my goals. They're important and this is what I need. Need. So no. put yourself first, flip it, and uh, make it uh, a non-negotiable for yourself. I love that. All right. Yeah. You've got uh, all of uh, Cynthia's information, uh, how to contact her, link to goodysacramento.com. Click, uh, uh, what's the other top of the... Uh, uh, link the website. Yeah, today's day, sorry. Show info. Show info. In today's day. I'm so excited about non negotiable. Yeah, I forgot. Uh, show info, then today's date, and you'll find out how to get a hold of uh, Smart Chick la Laser, laser focused, focused Mentoring. mentoring. Yes. All right. Thanks so much. Nice to see you. We'll Great see you next to see you. Month. Yes. All right. Uh, more goodie coming up right after the break.